Okay. Um, <clears throat> okay, so does that ending feel more doable to you? So it's going to probably take a good chunk of time to mm -hmm. really work this out. Um, I wanted to point out just a couple of things, little nuts and bolts, um, before we get to the phrasing in the other place. Let's see. Okay. So right here, you're going to tune this note. Mm -hmm. um, right. These guys are half step apart. Um, this one. Um, that B. Okay, this is the E tune. Um, and then um, this one right here, mm -hmm. I want you to hold your one down. You were doing that for all the rest of those places, but for some reason there you were lifting. these like double stops mm -hmm. right okay perfect this is the first one i actually played the nice oh song. okay good so that was probably a new feeling right and then same with these ones here too mm -hmm. um this one needs to be tuned that one was the that one was the biggest culprit <laughs> um luckily the nice thing about this is you've got your c and your g and that can that will totally ring with the mm -hmm. c string so it's it'll be very easy to hear whether it's in tune or not okay um all right let's talk about phrasing um i one of the i played this for my audition in october and this honestly i think was my best the best thing I had on it. Like it was my strongest thing. I, I mean, I worked really hard on everything, but I felt like this was the strongest thing I had. But one thing I hadn't thought about that one of the, um, I, I got to play for one of the national symphony cellists. She was um, willing to listen to me play. And this is a cello piece, mm -hmm. right? So um, one of the things she talked to me about was it's a scale and then an arpeggio, right? So we can kind of break it up in our minds that way. Da -da 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 arpeggio right so it can be a little bit more dramatic in just like this is not an etude but we can see what these are it's a scale and an arpeggio but it's just so beautiful right and so go in and try that and then we can hold this for like a million years okay. honestly we get to play a quarter note for a long time so we're going to milk it I think even longer is fine um, and so imagine yourself in a cathedral again I want you to be able to hear that sound, sound traveling back and then bouncing back towards you if you were in a cathedral, you want to be able to hear like how would how would it actually sound if there was an echo reverb effect, right? Thing about that after you try it. Okay. Good. I, like, I already like 
like that so much better. One last thing is, do you remember what the prelude is in the dance suites? These are dance suites, mm -hmm. right? Do you remember what the, have I, or have I taught you what a prelude is for before? I know we've talked about some of the other dances extensively, right? So the prelude is not actually one of the dances. The prelude, yeah, the prelude is like the time when the musicians get to show off and announce their presence. The dance is now about to start, right? So this, you can hear that's like a big declaration, right, at the beginning. Like, everybody stop eating. The dance floor is about to open. I don't know how they did it. Exactly, but you know, <laughs> like dinner is over. Mm -hmm. We are gonna dance now. So, um, um, good. I also am wondering.